Dear comrades, friends, we are very happy to be here. We salute the Palestinian people who set an example to the peoples of the world with their resistance. Their struggle is our struggle. Zionist Israel, the outpost of US imperialism, wants to take over the Palestinian people. The Palestinian people, with their struggle in every field, continue to be the moral of the struggle of the peoples of the world against imperialism and fascism. Every stone the Palestinian people threw at Israel, every bullet they fire, give us strength. The memories of slaughtered Palestinian mothers, babies, and brave young people feed our anger. We embrace the struggle more with our anger. The resistance and victories of Palestinian prisoners increase the struggle against imperialism. It shows the whole world that the only way to win is through resistance. Israel's most loyal ally, the AKP fascism, is that responsible for the crimes against the Palestinian people as it is in Turkey. AKP fascism is a friend of Israel, not of the Palestinian people. Israel got its strength from the US imperialism and Europe. Also, there is no freedom of found and organization in Europe. Our rights and freedoms are being suppressed by NATO's anti-terror laws. The most concrete example of this is clearly evident in the attacks on Turkish revolutionaries in Germany today. Musa Sholo has been in prison for six years for being a revolutionary. Group Bureau member Isan Jibili has been imprisoned for about six months today for reading fairy tales to children. Özgül Emre has been imprisoned for about six months for being a revolutionary journalist. Serkan Kipeli has been imprisoned for six months for being an anti-fascist. We also salute George Ibrahim Abdallah, who has been in the dungeons of French imperialism for 39 years. George Abdallah, who has become a symbol of the Palestinian people's struggles for freedom, is one of the rare examples of lifetime of struggle. We say it here again, and we will say it anyway again. We never feel, we never will fall down on our knees against imperialism. We are right, we will win. Yeah.